Hi guys, in this session you are going to learn about numeric functions in SAS. Function definition is a function is a component that can accept arguments and perform operation then return value. Numeric functions are used to perform only on numeric data type variables and the syntax is new variable equals to function and target variable in the bracket. The following are the numeric functions in SAS in that first one is int. Int function is used to give integer part of a decimal. Now we see the example for that data I named the data set name int and a equals to 12.6 and b equals to new variable here and int is the function and a is the target variable and c equals to directly we give some uh, number and then d equals to integer of c and g e equals to integer of directly 63.236 and run here what is the difference in it if you want to give a variable then directly you give a variable otherwise you can give the direct value also instead of variable now we are running this code before opening data set log is clear here we gave 12.6 then b equals to integer of a what it gives it gives integer part of a number and it's remove the decimal part of the number it means it directly give integer of decimal numbers okay c is a direct variable here and we give d of c that's why up to 63 we get in the d and 0.36 this decimal 36 will be removed by the integer are you got it integer only gives the integer value of a number and the next one is c it gives upper value then what does it mean and I, name, I created a data set and named the data set C and A equals to 12.6 and B equals to C is a function A is a target variable here and C equals to number and D equals to C of C and E equals to C of 632.36 and run here by the same example we change the function here the integer it gives the integer value it means it neglect the decimal part of a number now we giving c c means upper value got it then uh, how it will be before opening data set check log log is clear and c here here observe here a equals to 12.6 then what does it return it returns 13 it means if a number after point is greater than 5 it adds to the integer got it here here 12.6 is a a and b gives 13 by the seal we can get upper value what does it mean upper value here 12.6 if the point after point is any digit is there it's directly add add 1 to the integer it gives 13 like this here 63.36 and after whatever number is there it just add 1 to the integer then it gives 64 and here in the e we have 632.36 and 1 add to the it gives 633 like this uh, say it gives the upper value of an integer just add one to the end number of integer and the next one is floor it gives lowest value okay then how it will be we check and I named the data set floor a equals to 12.6 and b equals to flow of a and uh, c equals to number and uh, d equals to floor of c and e equals to floor of 632.36 again we are taking the same number for uh, easy understand 
now we are running this code before opening data set check lag lag is clear and flow then what it gives simply it neglects the decimal part of a number just like an integer that's why it's called as the lowest value flow got it whatever after decimal is there it will be neglected just like an integer it gives the integer value nothing but floor are you understand what is the difference between seal and floor here by the in the integer the same result we get in the floor also observe at once to well in the floor to well in the integer 632 it just gave a 632 here it means uh, the process is a uh, different but the result is same in the integer and floor now the next one is round round it gives the nearest value of a number then what does it mean of realest value in the number and i named the data set round and a equals to 12.6 again we are taking the same example for easy understand and b equals to round of a and c equals to number and d equals to round of c and run here before opening data set check lock lock is clear and round here observe clearly here 12.6 is there it means after point the number is above 5 and here after point the number is below 5 if the decimal part if the first number in decimal is greater than 5 then it adds to the integer that by it's a getting 13 here if the first number in a decimal point is below the 5 then it will be neglected are you got it in the round value if the first number in decimal part is greater than 5 then it adds to the integer just like here if the first decimal point below the 5 then it will be neglected just like an integer value got it this is the round and the next one n n gives non missing values it means whatever the values are present in it it will be given by the n then how it will be i named the data set n and a equals to n of these are the numbers and run we know that in the numeric the missing value represented by the dot here these are the missing values and these are the numbers then what it gives before opening data set log log is clear here it gives simply the number of presented values it means 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 the number of values are present 7 that's why in the output it just give 7 this is an n and the next one n miss it gives the missing values it means simply what are the observations are absent in that particular variable it will be displayed n miss and a equals to n miss of uh, we give a same number and run before opening data set check lag lag is clear and n miss here the number of missing values are 6 let me count 1 2 3 4 5 6 like this uh, we get missing and non missing values by the n and n miss and the next one is sum to, just, uh, to do just a sum and uh, I named the data set sum a equals to sum of we just give some random numbers in it and b equals to sum of uh, random numbers with the uh, missing value then what is the difference between these two we check by the result and c equals to directly we give instead of uh, use as a function if you directly give a plus symbol also it gives the value then d equals to same we check the result by the using function are directly by the numbers and run before opening data set check log log is clear and uh, what is the note missing values are generated that's why because we are giving a missing value that's why it's a missing values are generated now the sum here in the a is a directly 
give 28 the total number of adding that numbers and b gives 23 and c gives uh, 28 and d gives missing or you understand here if any missing value in the numbers by adding plus symbol it doesn't work by the sum function it consider this as the zero and adding the remaining numbers that's why in a we are getting 28 and uh, we are minus 5 that missing value consider as a zero and giving result but by adding symbols it throw missing value are you got it and simply if there any missing values in the adding numbers better to use some function instead of using plus symbol now next one is lag lag brings one observation step down then how it will be and i named the data set lag set slash help dot class lag is a, our variable lag is a function and age enter here lag is a new variable and here lag is the function before opening data set check lag lag is clear we are opening lag here we are apply lag on the edge that's why it one step down or you got it simply what lag uh, do it one step down in the observation and the last will be removed from the variable or you got it it one step down last value will be removed from the variable like this uh, we can step down one step down by using lag not only one step we can however the numbers want step down we can easily apply by the code and i named the data set lag 2 and set to lag and lag 1 equals to lag 4 of age and here what is the difference between these two conditions Simply, I am just giving number here. By represent number, the number of step downs will be decided. Okay, now we are running this code. Before opening data set, check lag. Lag is clear and uh, lag 2. Here we are giving 4. That's why it 4 step down in the variable. And the 4 down observation will be removed from the variable. Like this, uh, you can step down whatever number you want in the variable and the next one is differ differ gives difference and uh, enable the data set diff and set science elbow dot class diff equals to diff is a function here and age is the variable and diff one equals to difference of diff again we are applying diff and uh, diff three equals to diff of diff one and if 2 equals to age minus height and run. here what is the difference give in a one variable it differ by the upper variable okay i will explain by the result before opening data set lag lag is clear and diff here in the diff we are just giving age variable that's why 13 minus 14 is a minus one here there is a no upper value that's why it's a missing and here 13 minus 14 is a minus 1 and uh, 13 minus 13 0 14 minus 14 0 and here 14 minus 13 1 like this it will be differ to the upper variables and uh, just like this 0 minus minus 1 1 and uh, 1 0 1 0 1 minus 1 and again here 1 minus 1 0 and we can also difference of the variables age and height 14 minus 69 minus 55 13 minus 56.5 43.5 like this we can differ in a one variable of the observations and we can also differ two variables like this differ function will be work on the variables while practicing take your own examples to understand easily